Hey everybody, how's it going? This is Our House 21. I'm here with my son's friend Vince. And Robin. And Robin and Aaron and Nathan and Kyle. And... There's all the families here. Yep, and Vince's dad in the background too. So we are having a big joint bashing session. Although Vince's looks like Vince's batteries for his uh, for his mini e Revo may not be uh, happy right now, but he's going to take some time to fly his uh, his drone. Yeah, okay, I'll let you talk about your drone then. Go ahead. Uh, DJI Phantom Three standards. Not really much, but it's got good things. It's got GPS and everything like that. Good, good video. All right. Okay, so we're going to go and have ourselves a little fun time. This is going to be filming on his side. I'm going to be driving Scratch here, which has just been upgraded to the Castle um, Centric Motor setup with the Mama X ESC and a 1410-3800 KV motor. And um, Mrs. Our House just drove Kyle's uh, Rustler, uh, scra sorry, Rustler Traxel right into the woods. Yay. Yeah, yeah, yay. Yeah. But all right, we're going to play around a little bit. And yay, I get to drive. Yeah. Straight to the woods. Okay. Okay, now we're gonna start driving. In three, two, one. Wow. Okay, so okay. the big deal with these sensor motors is check this out. I know this doesn't look very impressive. But this car moves forward and backwards. No, but with a with a standard sensorless brushless motor, if you try to drive slow like this, it just won't happen. Ooh. Is that true? So, yes. So the uh, the ability to go slow and be controlled like this is just nuts. But oh. also watch this. So the new power system has definitely got some kick to it. Watch this. Now I mean, what you say by kick? And the drone's flying too. You're on your feet. You're on your feet. But can you move? All right. Okay, I lost the wheel. You lost a wheel? Look, look at that wheel. The wheel's sideways. So this is interesting. Vince has apparently murdered some small insect with his drone here. Manslaughter. Bug slaughter? In the first degree. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> okay, guys, so I've had a little bit of time to screw around with this new sensor motor setup. And this is so fun. Yeah, this this changes the personality of the car completely. And what I'm... And we'll drive again. Let's Okay. Let's look at the regular one. So if you watch, you see Vince's car, the Mini E-Revo, trying to go slow speed, you hear it is cogging. Oh, go ahead and get close to it. So see how it's chattering like that? That's because the sensor motor or the sensor less motor does not know where the rotor is and is trying to get it moving. And it's just not having a good day. So let's look at Kyle's rustler here. Kyle, go ahead, nice slow. Because that has that sensor, it knows exactly where the rotor is and he can do nice, precise, slow motions. Now that might not seem that impressive to some of you guys who are used to like crawling with really, really low, who are used to like rock crawling with really low gear ratios, but that car is over here like crazy. Slash, oh sorry, my slash Daddy. here is scratch. Um, mommy, I oh. need help. Oh, hold on. Did you say please? Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> okay. All right. So, so Traxel is geared for about 40 or so mile an hour speed, which is not speed run speed, but it's a lot faster than uh, standard. Whoa, and we got it. <laughs> nice. I'm a god. Okay, so well, back on the orange car. <laughs> okay, so but you notice on this like on the slash 4x4 here again This car is actually geared for about 40 or so miles an hour as well much much higher than stock gearing Yet I'm able to we got on a camera, but this car is set for much higher than stock speeds But I'm able to creep around very slowly without cogging 
very smooth. This car never performed like this or never could move like this before. But because I have this extra motion, I can go from low speed performance to high speed hilarity. <laughs> okay guys so every time i go out with kyle i find the most interesting ways to break my cars all right <clears throat> so this time so this time we rigged up a nice little jump and i hit the jump the jump was fun but then somehow the yoke that connects my rear drive shaft broke so i had this nice little experience right here and usually i'm prepared for this and i have an entire pack of extra dry shafts, but somehow that didn't make my toolbox. So I fell victim to my rule number one, always be prepared, I wasn't. So, so what I did is I actually took a good yoke from the front, transplanted it to the back, removed the rest of the front dry shaft. So now this is three wheeling. So now I have a slash three by four, <laughs> but it runs and is happy. So I'm going to continue to bash with it. And, and this can't end badly at all. Looks like this stun might not work too well. well. I was trying to see if I could rock fall with a slash, but three-wheel three drive isn't cooperating with me. Don't Nathan, make it over no here, Daddy. Daddy, it's going to overheat if you keep pressing it. Okay, good thing about the bigger tires, I really forever. That's, that's it. What? I can't run. Oh, look. Actually, you're not doing too bad. Good thing I got this on camera. <laughs> Yay, trio. <laughs> I mean, I can't. I'm, I'm the best at rock climbing because I have all the rubber and I keep it high down. <laughs> See, with these tires, I'm not the look, best at it. Look, I'm flexing. <laughs> nice. Yeah, Rob's recording. Yeah, I got this all on camera. We can compare the senseless and the senseless to rock climbing. Yay, let's do it. Well, the problem is I'm only three while so I end up dipping out. I got you, I got you. Four without the wings. <laughs> uh, wow. 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 Okay. Wow. So Robin Quick. Whoa. <laughs> and I didn't get that on film. Alright, go ahead, babe. Okay, so Robin is gonna take a chance of driving Kyle's car here. Okay, so now my son Aaron, so now my son Aaron is actually driving the car. And Aaron could never have driven this car this way without the censored motor. <laughs> okay, Aaron, back it up. <laughs> okay, turn it around, Aaron. Because he, he actually has low speed throttle control. without sacrificing any power. Are you okay? I'm fine. Good job, Aaron. Come here, buddy. Careful, guys. Go, oh, go towards the empty, the empty area. Aaron, you're doing a great job. Oh, Aaron, Aaron! Air brake. Brake, pull forward, forward. Now reverse it. There you go. That's hard. Did he flip it over like in power? Okay, that was special. At least he's running to get it. That's Careful, Robin. Robin's pretty good, No, Robin's got it. Robin's a pretty good driver.
So I can go from slow and precise to high speed in a moment's notice. So I can get the best of both worlds, bashing and control. This is awesome. Plus, <laughs> this is CNN. No, but, but seriously, this is this 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 is really really cool. So and and I it feels like the car has a lot more low end power as well. Uh, maybe that's just because I never really used the low end before because it used to always cog. So I had to pretty much go right to high to high gear, but. Okay, Nathan, watch out. You want to that? Ah! <laughs> yeah, I like it when it flips back over. And it sticks to landing. Yeah, I like that. Well, let me try for a little bit more and I'll give it back to you. Okay, Dad. You know, driving in an RC car is awesome. Don't hit the toes. Okay, so Kyle is about to demonstrate. All right, so Kyle, go ahead, let it rip. And remember, this. This is not a 1410. This is not a 1410. Yes, he did. This is a 4600 KV 1406. And this thing is torquey. And this thing is kicking. I really like it. Like, it's able to go slow, controllably. And when I'm going fast, like, the power on it is much more. Ah, I can't wait. It's better than what I had before, because what I had before was two pole, this one is now four. So it's pretty much a pretty decent upgrade. Okay, so 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 everyone knows this car actually previously had a a castle two pole CM36 4600 KV motor with the Sidewinder FB3 setup. So it was not a bad setup at all. But Kyle was having continual problems with it overheating. Kyle was having problems with this thing overheating. <laughs> that didn't sound happy. Are you good? I want to go check on it. <laughs> yeah, I'm. A, I'm a... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Just. <laughs> All right. What did you do? In the middle of bragging too. No, that's not the motor's fault. That, that's, that's me. A, that's a Kyle problem. <laughs> yeah, that that is definitely a Kyle problem. I got you this. Tighten the slipper too much. Did I? I you may have over tightened the slipper. Okay. Never mind. I got this. Okay. Uh, actually, no. Okay. Let's. Okay, I'll, I'll lift it up. You give it a little throttle. Okay. It, ow! <laughs> Robin just ran over my leg. Light throttle. Okay, it's spinning. I feel. I just. I just want to look in, check on it. Okay. It sounds like that reminds me of the sounds that will happen when it's grinding up gears. Okay, go ahead. Make sure it's not grinding gears. Going to plastic, just gone. <laughs> just powder everywhere. Good thing we brought wheat seed. That's thing we know we got. We got extra gears. Hopefully, we do have extra gears for this one. Yes. All right. So wait, where did? Okay, so we actually have to do, stop and do a quick pit change here. But what had happened was uh, the new motor is actually torquey enough for the 48 tooth or the 48 pitch gears that we had in here actually stripped out. It's so good that Kyle doesn't know how to handle it. Yeah, so what? So Kyle basically, isn't powerful enough. So Kyle, Kyle over Kyle overran the gears basically. He so we upgraded him to mod point eight or 54. I'm sorry, 48. That's no, not 48 pitch. We upgraded him to, I think it's 32 pitch. Uh, no, not 1,000. It's Mach 0.8 slash gears. Not Mach. Mach 8, whoa. Okay, anyway. <laughs> the boys are having themselves a good time. But basically, I, I upgraded Kyle to slash quality gears so that he's got much more um, 
much more beefy teeth going on in here. And it's about the same ratio. So it's a 54 2 and a 13 2. So I think this is actually the slash. I believe this is the slash 4x4 stock gear setup. I'll double check that. Anyway, let's go ahead and see how this car lights. So now this. we've got stronger gears and go ahead and. So, so finish telling us what you think about it. So I really like it because with the new motor and ESC, it's not overheating that much like it used to. It hasn't overheated at all. Yeah, so like before, mine would like overheated a few times by now. This one hadn't even once got close. So now it has more control. I know it do more tricks because it's new and more power. And it's just overall really good. And I really like it. So would you recommend the Castle censored setup to anybody looking for an upgrade to their car? Yes. I mean, okay, you've driven the stock brush system. You've driven... You've driven See, I'm the uh, only one in this family who's driven all three. Ooh, 360. Because you started straight out of brushless. So I had a brush motor, and then I got the upgrade, and now I'm upgrading again. So I can say, like, as I've been going up, it's been getting... Yeah, so as I've been going up, like, it's like much better. Like, brush is okay. Brushless is better, and this one is even better, because even, like, right, like, slow down, and I go super slow with the pins. And I don't have to, like, worry about chuckling. Like Chuckling? That. You mean cogging? <laughs> Chuckling sounds better. But yeah, uh, we wanted to go on like a little train, like trying to chuck along. So I also can do more precise movements now. See, I can be even more controlled chaos. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna go set up the ramp again. All right, I got it. No. Okay, so Vince actually had a Stampede 4x4. No, I had a Stampede. That's all right. Vince actually had a Stampede two-wheel drive. I still with, have it. It's just dead. Yeah, but it's got a castle. Um, I think it's got a it's got fourteen ten in it, doesn't it? Uh, yeah. Yeah. It's so fourteen hundred three. Yep. A oh, fourteen hundred. I think so. Okay, so that would be a 1406, 4600 yeah. kV. So basically, it's the same motor that Kyle. Uh, actually, no, it was the, the the successor to the motor that Kyle had in this car. So um, so, all right, go ahead, goose it. Tell me what you think. Oh yeah, don't break my car. This is nice. <laughs> this is much better. Mine is, is like, mine is, I feel like, what mine does, mine tends to overheat when I do a lot of braking, because I tend to go crazy and then brake. This one I feel like is a lot smoother and more controlling. I have a lot more control over each movement instead of like flooring and hoping for the best. Not that flooring and hoping for the best is a bad thing. And you can do each tricks easier, like with four. I don't think I'd go to do it in 360 on four. Well, uh, you got two things going on with this car right now. You've got the uh, you've got the beefier, the Mamba X ESC, which is a lot beefier than the uh, than the ESC in your car. And then after you gas the brake, you put the gas again, the car is going to be the same. Just put it in the be going fast. Nice. See, that's easy to do. You got to go, brake turn, you got to commit. I can't roll with it. I can't hold really. Yeah, this thing can just yeah. really hold it. This is a torque monster. Yeah, I can't do that. Mine just doesn't really pop, it flips over or, or it just falls over. Yeah, yeah, your goes uneven. Like, it's just My, really mine doesn't, starts mine doesn't know what it's doing. It's just, it's, just, <laughs> it's just, imagine a zombie that only just wants power. This is actual human that just wants power. It has a brain. It's just like, zombies have brains. It doesn't work. They eat brains. They don't have one. I'm not a zombie. Actually. Nice wheelie stand. Yeah, this, this is good. I like this. Any spares? <laughs> Any spares? Pass over. Right. Right. Thanks. Sweet. Nice. Okay, I should have upgraded you to the slash gears a long time ago. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You have an upgrade. You just have a I know. <laughs> no, I, those were gears from my slash. Do you have the cover on? No, I, I don't know. I don't know if the cover fits. We can check it real fast. No. Okay. Go driving over the grass. It would just mulch up the grass. That's all. Okay. Nice. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. So this concludes our little bashing session, but. One thing, scratch has worked a lot. He needs some rest. <laughs> yeah, Scratch worked a lot. He needs a little rest. All right. Scratch. Okay, but things that we learned. I really like this new castle sensor setup. This. Did you my castle? No, but uh, just objectively. So I still get all the good power that I like from the 1400 series. But in addition, 
Now I also have control. <laughs> what did you do? So this right here, this was an experiment. I had some flash tires, he had a mini E-Revo, we wanted to see what would happen. Okay, so my review of it is, good thing. It does <laughs> massive wheelies and can do off-roading way better. Bad thing, it flips over every five seconds. Wow. Yeah. You can just go. And then wow. Okay guys, so we had a great bashing session. The, the the overall impression of the new Castle Censored Motors is that they're great. Everybody likes them. So the overall, the impressions, you know, these, these motors, they still have all the same high power capability that the old uh, sensorless motors do, but you get a whole lot of low end control now that you just did not have before. So this, this opens up a new world of flexibility for even like a basher like this car. So I give it a, a thorough overall thumbs up. You guys did a great job. Double thumbs up. All right, guys. So Our House 21 and Robin and Vince and Kyle and Nathan and Aaron and Mrs. Our House and Mrs. Dad. It's the Our House family all owing a big thank you for Castle. <laughs> all, so everybody. And, and, Bashing never truly ends. With and the there's Kyle again. All right. But okay, guys. Our House 21 and family signing out. Remember the mantra. Fly, fix, fly. Break it, fix it, and do it all over again. Peace. Can keep on smiling.